Hey guys, what's going on? So, um, welcome to part two of the 16 by 16 grid ISO area water bomb based tessellation. Okay, so yep, this is part two. Okay, and this is going to be the collapsing. Okay, and yeah, and it's pretty cool and it squishes like that. Okay, and if you haven't done the pre creasing yet, I have a separate video for that right here. Okay, so here I have the pre creasing right here. Okay, and now you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna collapse it now to so form the tessellation, okay? Alright, so here it goes. <clears throat> Alright, so let's start out by making this into an accordion first. So let's just make this a mountain. Like this, make that crease a mountain. Okay, oh, it's crease sharply on the surface, okay? And now you can just pleat it up like this. Okay? Just like this. Just pleat it up like that on the existing creases. It just makes the collapsing a bit easier. Okay? Just like this. Just like this. Just You don't need to do this if you don't want to, okay? I just I just like doing it because I, I just want it it just makes the collapsing easier okay maybe it helps to fold this up too okay just like this and fold this up okay so here, here we have our fan now unfold it okay and now let's make let's make this crease look Let's unfold the fan now. Okay. Alright, now let's make this crease right here a mountain. So it's the second crease up from this edge right here. Okay? So just like this. Let's make, let's make this crease a mountain like this. Okay? And here we go. Let's start collapsing it now. So, um, and now let's make, let's make that little crease a mountain too. Okay? Just like that. Now, Let's pinch this crease right here, see, like this, and now we're just going to make a half water bomb base right here, okay? So just take it and just do it like that, okay? That should be fairly easy because it's we're doing it right on the existing creases, okay? And yeah, and now just keep doing that, okay? You can make that crease mountain right there, and just keep doing that all the way across. Okay, and keep doing that. this okay just like that okay so there so that's that's one row right there okay see looks like a zigzag okay all right and now let's turn over and let's do the same thing. So we're gonna lift up this here. Let's I'm, I'm gonna show you. Let's lift up this crease right here. See, just like that. Lift it up. Okay, it's just like in my. It's just like in this one right here. See the simple one. Okay. All right. So now, and we're gonna reverse these creases right here though. So the valleys becomes mountains now, and the mountains become valleys. So like this. But we're gonna do it as we collapse, okay? So <clears throat> pinch here and just collapse it right on these increases. And now just 
you do not all the way across, okay? Just like this. Okay, just like that. Yeah, I told you this is, this is tricky. But the more further down you go, the easier it gets, okay? It gets a little easier the further you go down, okay? Because the fan gets shorter, okay? When the fan is longer like this, it's, it's, it's a little trickier to collapse. But when the fan is shorter, it's easier to collapse. To me, I think it's easier. Okay. Okay, just like that. And there's the second row done, okay? And it's ISO area, see? All right, now turn over and do the same thing. Do exactly what we did before. Lift up that 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 crease right there. Okay. Okay. Now reverse the fan so make the valleys into mountains and mountains into valleys. Like this. Okay. There it is. That's what it looks like. Okay. And now turn over and just keep doing that until you until you reach the bottom, okay? Keep 
keep doing it until you reach it. See? And notice it gets easier because the fan gets shorter and shorter, okay? Which is good. Okay, so we've got row done, and turn over, and do the same thing. over and same thing Yeah, and it might crunkle a little bit right there, okay? But that's okay. We'll put up with that. It might crunkle a little bit on some of them, okay?
like that. See how the tessellation is taking shape? Okay. Alright, now turn over and do the same thing. Okay. And this is the easiest one because the fan is the shortest right here. <laughs> yeah. But it can, still, it can still be tricky for beginners, so. Yeah. Because it's still collapsing it, so it can still be kind of tricky. Okay. Collapsing the model is not easy. It's hard. Okay, alright, so if you like it like this, then you're done, but if you want to make it look like this, where it's more, you know, more more of a zigzag up here and down here and stuff like that, then here's what we can do. So, let's, um, we're going to we're gonna turn over like this, and let's just, we're going to make some reverse folds that go along this part right here, so just take it and just reverse fold it like that on the existing crease, okay? And this is definitely a lot easier than the collapsing and stuff like that, so yeah. These reverse folds shouldn't be that hard. Okay? Especially if you're doing them right on the existing uh, creases. Okay, just like that. Alright, so that's what it looks like. Now, let's do it on this side now, so... We're just going to do the reverse folds on the existing creases like this. Okay. So, there you have it. There it is. Let's fix that one. Okay. All right. Well, there it is. The sixteen by sixteen grid ISO area water bomb based tessellation. So there it is. Well, hope you guys had some luck at that. Okay. I know it's a pretty tricky model, but, um, yeah. So if you weren't able to do it, well, if you still haven't made this, I have a video for that right here, okay? But, yeah, there it is. So, yeah. So I think this is pretty cool. It's pretty cool looking, too, especially if you squish it like this. So it's like a squishy tessellation, too, okay? So, there you have it. Well, maybe I should try to design one with a 32 by 32 grid. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I'm. I don't think I have the. I have to wait until I have patience. I hope I have enough patience for it, for a 32 by 32 grid. I don't know it's gonna be a lot of pre-creasing. Okay, but all right. So there it is. Well, hope you guys like that, and I'll see you guys later.